I'm Sean Tavellia, and we're here at Suffolk County Community College to answer the question, what happens to the pressure of a gas if we decrease the volume by half? To answer that, we have to understand what pressure is. Pressure is uh, the force per unit area, and the force is a result of little collisions between atoms and molecules within the vessel along the surface. As we decrease the volume of the vessel, with the same number of atoms and molecules, it will increase the number of collisions between those atoms and molecules with the surface. And if we increase the number of collisions, we should increase the pressure within the vessel. So to do that, we have a system where we can set up and measure the pressure, uh, just a hyper, uh, basically a syringe, and a pressure sensor. And all we need to do is decrease the volume in the syringe, right now it's at 20 milliliters, and now I'm going to reduce the volume to 10 milliliters. And by doing that, we've increased the pressure, we've decreased the volume by half, we should see a corresponding increase in pressure by two. So the original pressure will increase by two. 